my name is Tim McCormack with TMAC Development. Welcome to our latest luxury home build. We're going to take you on a tour today of this beautiful home that's 6,800 square feet located in Paradise Valley, Arizona. We partnered with Mark Candelaria, architect from Candelaria Design on this one, and we just wanted to show you how we design and build some of these beautiful details on this home. Let me show you the master bedroom. We're going to walk down this amazing hallway. You can take a look. We do LED lighting all the way down the hallways, herringbone wood floor. We went for the boutique hotel experience in here with the luxury wall coverings on the wall. Large fireplace wrapped with granite. We've got a large seating area right here with the outdoor patio. We're going to show you the master bathroom now. One of our favorite things is the automation. We've got automated blinds, which we just love. The entire house is wired for fully automated blinds, window treatments, split floor plan in here, his and hers, luxury Toto toilets with bidet options. And coming around this corner, you're going to see the steam shower. Now we're going to show you the office. Also has automated shades in here from Crestron. Full video conferencing, so you can handle all of your office meetings virtually from this seat in the house right here. Welcome to the great room. This is one of our favorite places in the entire house. It connects everybody when they come in or you're entertaining. The entire flow just goes right through this whole area. Double island. This gives an informal way or place to eat right here. And then your formal kitchen prep. One of our favorite things about this house is this Viking rose gold. We were lucky enough to get this. Uh, there's 110 of these made. And with our connections, our suppliers, they allowed us to get one of these. We're pretty pleased about it. We're also the first to have a fully matte black appliance package from Viking matching house with the rose gold. If you come this way, I'll show you the pantry. So if you're entertaining, you can set up all of your catering. That can flow through here. This is a hidden door that you can't see from the outside. Then flows right into this butler's pantry right here. One of the best features about this house is this Crestron fully automated system right here. You've got your cameras, your stereo system, all of your integrated light systems. It's just the best way to control the entire house. Follow me into the game room. This can be set up for full theater room. If you're a car guy, we've designed this wall right here to be full glass floor to ceiling. Uh, and this will look right out at your car collection. Welcome to the guest lounge located on the south side of the house. Over here, there's three en suites, three bedrooms, three baths. Now for my favorite part of the house is the garage. We actually climate control our garages. One of the things that we do is insulated garage doors, powder coated door frames. We also spray the walls with armor plate, which is a spray cork, which keeps a lot of the heat out in your garage and helps with the, uh, with the cooling in here. This is the man cave. One of my favorite spots. <laughs> got your tool bench. You've got metal countertops in here, hot rolled steel. We even did a real cool light feature to kind of pair the steels together. Aluminum cabinets with toolbox style handles on them. And then who doesn't love a lift? 
You can stack two cars in here, house comes with it. We also put in a hose bib so you can wash your car, put the spot free car wash with the deionized water. It's also wired for air compressors, welders. Turn this thing into a full shop. Welcome to the backyard. This is just set up for full entertainment. We've got a huge pool. We've got bocce ball courts in the back over here off my right shoulder. For the exterior hardscape, we used reclaimed brick pavers from Chicago. They're called Old Chicago Bricks. These ones came from a building that was torn down uh, recently in Chicago, uh, and I was told that the bricks were dated from the early 1900s. One of the cool things is, is you can see some of them that were actually on fire and come with the black chard. Thanks for doing the walkthrough with us on our latest luxury home project. If you're interested in any of our other projects, we've got two more on deck. Thanks for coming out.